Hello, you fellow Pokemon Geeks and Minecrafters alike. Welcome to another episode of Minecraft Mondays, where we're slowly whittling down the server into Thunder Bedrock and losing the mines. Uh, so let's just get down to it and don't forget if you like the series, comment, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Let me know when our video goes live. Also, don't forget to check all notifications as well as check out the links in the description box below for my Twitch and Twitter accounts and all of that good stuff. Um, that's just this is just such a I find it fun. I don't know how you guys feel about it, but it's fun to me to do this. Um, it's, it's fun, it's cool, I like doing it. It's spooky. You yeah. never know what's below the rock. Twitch, I do play a lot of Animal Crossing, I do play some Pokemon, speaking of, there should be some more, some playthroughs stuff going on here on Pokemon as well, assuming if it's not already by the time this video is live. There's lots of stuff coming to the channel or on the channel already that you guys will be able to enjoy. I hope you do. Nice and just nice and easy, easy and nice. Speaking of, well, I wasn't speaking of yet, but um, the cool things that I learned about Pokemon are with the variants, the Chinese and stuff like that. Um, a lot of changes have actually happened with the colorations from uh, Gen 2, which is the inaugural gen that started the Chinese. So, current, the current ones. Um, the most cruel, in my opinion, has to be uh, Smeargle. Basically, the non-shiny form and the shiny form switched places where the shiny is, was red. Or was green. It had the green tip on the tail and stuff, and the non-shiny was red. Well, they switched that, and I don't remember where I saw it, but I saw a picture of a person who was shiny hunting in a virtual console, console of crystal, and they came across a shiny smeargle, and I guess they missed the sparkle animation and stuff, 
and they just saw it, that it was green and didn't know about the color swap and they abandoned it and that was like the most painful thing in the world <laughs> Because the odds back then were 1 in 8,096. There wasn't a way to modify it, modify that. Except for breeding, of course. Oh, look, the cave. We'll see how deep it goes in a minute. But there's a cave there. Hopefully it doesn't go too, too deep. Because... Filling in hole, filling in the holes of the cave takes quite something to do. So hopefully it doesn't go too deep. It looks like it doesn't go too too far down. I could be wrong. I could be horribly, horribly, horribly wrong. <laughs> Uh, that's the actually weirdly enough the first Pokemon that I failed getting was the was a um what was it it was a Whismur I encountered a Whismur horde and there was a shiny in it and I didn't know. That if you didn't, if you tapped on a space that was not occupied by a Pokemon in the horde, or was no longer occupied, that it would go automatically to the left of where you clicked, and that's where the shiny bug is, and I knocked it out. So that was unfortunate, but hey, it happened. Things happen, you know. Like I said, it doesn't look like this little cave. It looks like the cave is small right here. So it won't take too long to fill it in. Good, because we don't have much time left in the episode. I try to keep it around 10 minutes. Sometimes if I lose track of time, or the story goes a little bit longer, or whatever, I can go a little bit longer, but... And of course, there's the... oops. Wait, no, oh shoot. Okay, so there's more of a cave system than I thought that would, huh? Looks like it goes a little bit further down in here. But we're not going to worry about that if we don't have to. But yeah, my first failed Pokemon on stream was a, a Halucha that I was breeding for. It was Masuda Methane 4. And I released it with the batch after I named it and everything. And it was not cool. That was that truly was devastating. But I did not save the clip, save a clip or a highlight or anything of it. So there's no documentation of that. I did redeem it though. I did redeem myself with it. So I got it back. It took several years of hunting to get it back, but I got it, and that's the point of our redemption. You get it back. So I am simply blocking these little caves off so that I don't get distracted. It's very easy easy to get distracted. Now we've got about 20 seconds left, so I'm gonna end here. Uh, so thank you guys for watching. If you want to watch more videos, go ahead and comment, like, subscribe, click the notification bell, turn all notifications on, 
Again, check the links in the description box below for Twitch and Twitter. And the end screen elements will have a link to this playlist as well as the next video whenever the next new video goes live. So we will see you on the next one. Bye.